Hello! Welcome to the Perfecto Scriptless Mobile Introduction course. In this video, we will learn how to create a test for a web application in the Scriptless Mobile tool from scratch. In order to demonstrate how to create a test from scratch, we will automate the following scenario. Open Safari browser and go to helperfecto.io website, clean cookies, rotate the device, wait for 3 seconds, add screenshot to the report and close the browser. Now let's see how to create this test in Perfecto Scriptless Mobile. To prepare for test creation, I have already opened a scriptless mobile and chosen a device to work with. We have learned how to do this in the previous video. We are going to use left comments and checkpoints section for creating this test. First, we need to open a browser and navigate to the URL. To cover both actions, we can choose a browser go to command. We are going to drag and drop this command from the left menu to the test area. Now we need to specify the URL to navigate to. For that, we need to edit the details of this command. We can do it in two different ways. First, simply double click the needed command. Second, choose a command and click Edit Test Element. In the configuration dialog for the browser go to command, we can see the URL option where we can fill in our value and click Apply to save the changes. Next step in the test scenario is to clean cookies. For that, we will open a cookie folder and choose a delete all cookies command. Next step to add to our test is a device rotation. To add this step, we will open a device section, find rotate device command and add it to the test area. Next, we will add a wait for 3 seconds. For this, we will choose a wait function. Open the command settings, we we'll double click and set a wait duration value. Next step will be adding the screenshot for the report. To do so, we will drag a screenshot command from the left menu to the test area. And as a final step, we will close the browser application. In order to perform this action, we choose a close application action and open the command settings. Here we need to check the application name parameter and add a value Safari. Now our test is ready. In the next videos we will see how to run a test and view a test report. Thank you for watching the video.